In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make McAfee Firewall automatically block new or pre-installed programs from connecting to the internet. So let's open up McAfee Firewall or Security Center. Sometimes this can be found down here on the bottom taskbar here, such as here, it's a little red icon, so click on that and then open up the Security Center. If you can't find it down there, you can also find it through the Windows menu here, or you can use the search box here, just type in McAfee. So if you click on the, on the menu and scroll down to the letter M and under M you should see McAfee, it may be in a subfolder such as so here, so open that up. So once the McAfee Security Center opens up, you want to look for your firewall. This can be found through the PC security here in the top toolbar. You can also find it through the gear icon here to select firewall such as so. So what we want to do to start programs, whether they are new or already installed on your PC from connecting to the internet is quite simple. Select the traffic control here and by default smart access is enabled. This allows the firewall to decide where the programs are allowed incoming and outgoing internet access based on their factors. Personally, I don't like this. So to make sure any program before it connects to the internet, it has to have your permission. What you want to do is select stealth. This hides your PC from others, lets you decide whether a known programs can connect to the internet. So once that's done, click apply. You can also for added security, select the next option here, which is smart advice. Again, you can see this is enabled. So by, by default, it decides automatically. You can again, choose to ask, ask yourself whether a program can connect. Again, click apply. So basically that's it. So once you do install a new program or an existing program tries to connect to the internet, you should get a little box down here in the bottom right hand corner. And it basically allows you to block or give access to that particular program. So that's how you do it. Thanks for watching.